bacon. Some people say they know how to cook bacon the best, but do they really? Today, we're gonna cook bacon three ways and decide which way is the tastiest. On this episode of Cooking, Cooking with Coop. You need to know how to make bacon. Yeah. Everybody needs to know how to make bacon. Oh yeah. Today, we're gonna make it in the pan, in the air fryer, and in the microwave. Okay, that sounds like a nice little experiment. And I say we start with the, the pan. pan. You're gonna place three slices of bacon in your favorite pan. You're gonna turn up the heat, and you're gonna let it rip. Halfway through, you're gonna flip them, and when you see them starting to get crunchy around the edges, you're gonna have to drain the fat into a glass bowl or a coffee mug. Just drain that fat out and then keep the bacon in the pan and just keep her going till you get it to the point that you like it. When it's done, you pull it out and you place it on a paper towel to absorb up some oil. All right, there's our bacon all cooked up nice in the pan. Now it's up for the next one, which is the... Microwave. The microwave. <laughs> You're gonna grab some paper towels. You're gonna lay the three slices of bacon on top of the paper towel and put it in the microwave. Place one more towel on top of bacon. Okay. Close the door and set it for one minute per slice of bacon. Okay, okay. Now, when we were cooking it, um, it took a little longer, right? Yes, so it did. So maybe you just gotta eyeball it. You gotta really eyeball do. it. And yeah. Do cook it to your own delight. Yes, cook it till it's crisp enough, and that's that. Okay, there's our microwave bacon. Okay, okay, okay. Now it's time for the air fryer. The air fryer. We preheated our air fryer for a couple minutes Gotta and then we just placed the bacon right on in it. And then what did we set it on, Cooper? We set it on Max Crisp, <laughs> our favorite mode. <laughs> and what was it, for 10 minutes? 10 minutes. 10 but minutes. We checked it along the way mm -hmm. and we noticed it was cooking faster than that. So I say just cook it till you like it. Yep, keep your eye on it, pull it out when you think it's ready. Yep, and that's it. All right, we got all of our bacon done and it's time for the, the taste, taste test. First up, our pan fried bacon. Yes, I feel like this is kind of like the classic way to cook bacon, right? I agree. Yeah. I feel like most people cook it like this. Yeah. So I feel like it's gonna be a familiar taste. Yes, All let's right. do it. Let's go for it. <laughs> Thank <Bake>. you. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Bacon. That is good. I'd say a good pro for this bacon is that it has a really good bacon flavor, <laughs> right? <laughs> Another pro is it made us some bacon grease. Look at that, y'all. We'll be cooking with that all week. But we need to talk about the cons. Yes, the cons, Mom. This blew up my stove. There's grease everywhere. It's hard to clean. It's a pain in the neck. Yeah, if you want to spare yourself some cl major cleaning action, <laughs> maybe this isn't the best way to do it. Next up. Microwaved bacon. Microwaved bacon, yeah. This one looks kind of funny, mm -hmm. but I, I'm not gonna say anything. We're, we're gonna give it the taste for it. <laughs> There's your first con right there. <laughs> it's a little brittle. <laughs> Let's right. try that again. <laughs> it's a little dry. <laughs> uh, it's a little, yeah, too crunchy. You, it tastes good, but. It still does taste good, yeah. Obviously it's still bacon. Right. Sounds like good. But we cooked it with all those paper towels, right? And it really like absorbed yeah. all of the moisture. All the bacon and the oh. moisture. I mean all the bacon. All the bacon. <laughs> it absorbed the bacon. It absorbed. <laughs> it absorbed. <laughs> it absorbed. <laughs> it absorbed. What he <laughs> said. Another con, it did not make any bacon fat. No bacon fat, no nothings. So that's, it's that's all not in the, good. All in the paper towel. Right. And you, we just threw that away. So and Lots of it too. Yeah. It wasn't super environmentally friendly. <laughs> no, we threw away a lot of paper towels. <laughs> and if you're conscious about that, you're going to feel sad. It was that. Yeah. It was kind of was okay. middle road. Yeah. yeah. All right. So I guess we'll go for our air fryer. Yes. I'm excited <laughs> about this. I hope it's good. This we haven't really done before. So it's a little bit of an experiment, but look good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, mm, the flavor's developing mm -hmm. in my mouth. Mm. It actually does taste kind of different mm. from the other ones. It's still moist, it's but not crisp. so brittle. Yeah. The flavor is different though. Do you it notice is. that? I do, I notice the difference. What do you think that is? I have no idea. <laughs> we 
What's the science behind that? Grass man had no idea. I have no idea. Can you tell me what's going on with this? I'd like an explanation. If you know why the air fryer tastes a little bit different, leave it down in the comments. We'd love to know. Yeah. Okay, so Ma, now that we have tasted all of the bacon, it is time to decide which method of cooking bacon was the best. What do you think? Pan fried! Pan fried! Really? Yes, okay, yes. Why, why do you think that? Despite the mess, it made the best tasting bacon. I agree. Yeah. It was, it was messy, y'all. But <laughs> this is just classic. It it's is. just a classic. It's perfect. Pan wins. All right. Good job, Coop. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. And thank you guys for watching. We hope you enjoyed. We hope you can like and subscribe. The <laughs> subscribe. You know how to subscribe? subscribe. I can teach you. <laughs> it's a new form of subscribing. Make sure to like and subscribe. Maybe leave a comment down below. And we will see you in the next one. Bye, everyone. See ya.